What's going on guys? Butterbar here. Welcome back to the channel. Hopefully you guys are all having a good day today. We got two things to talk about. First, we got some Titanfall 2 news, man. If you are a Titanfall 2 streamer and you've been wanting to stream it on PC, we've been dealing with the DDoS attacks on PC. It's been a really big headache for a lot of people that are wanting to stream on PC. Well, there's a little bit of a workaround. Somebody's actually created a mod to where it helps people out actually staying remained unknown, we'll say. Players are unknown, enemies are unknown, front layers are unknown, everybody's unknown, but it does help mitigate the DDoS attacks that are happening on Titanfall 2. And I want to talk about that. I want to boost it. Iniquity's been using this mod, um, and he's been enjoying it. He's been streaming Titanfall 2, and he hasn't had any issues so far, at least from using this mod to stream and having a good time. So I want to talk about it. I want to boost it, and definitely want to push it out there to you guys if you are PC players and you're wanting to stream Titanfall 2 on PC. Next, this is the one thing. I want to talk about the Season uh, 9 or Legacy Season a gameplay trailer for Apex Legends because it, it revealed Arena. Now, this has been one thing that's been... It, it's It's been revealed. People knew about uh, Arena, this 3v3 game mode that's coming to Apex Legends that's going to be a permanent game mode. Not only that, but they also revealed Valkyrie, which then everybody knew about Valkyrie from her, from her revealed trailer. But I want to give you guys my honest opinion about what I think about this 3v3 game mode now look i am super happy that apex legends is finally getting a different game mode br to me and i i'm assuming it's going to a lot of people br is just getting way too tired it is just a horse that is just non-stop beaten to the ground every single game has a br and doesn't really focus on any other part of the game you can look at cold war to see that man cold war or call of duty used to be 6v6 ground war 9v9 whatever it is all switching over to battle royale and that's similar to kind of what it's happened in the titanfall uh titanfall uh universe and whatnot it's kind of going towards br well this is something that's kind of a breath of fresh air that 3v3 is coming to apex legends do i think that 3v3 is something that i'm excited for not really. I mean, look, you go back to Titanfall 2 and all the game modes that were in that game. Whoo, man. It's a lot of game modes, man. A lot of game modes. A lot of intensity in those games with attrition, bounty hunt. And there was all different types of game modes between PvP and all that stuff with objectives and stuff. There was a lot of innovation in Titanfall 2. I don't know how much we're seeing that in Apex Legends, even with just a 3v3 game mode. Now, look. I want to. I want to shoot. I want to shoot it straight to you. I think you're seeing a lot of overhype with this new season, with season nine, and I don't want to do that. I want to. I want to be as honest to God as I possibly can to you. You deserve it. And look, I'm not going to be overhyped about something I'm not excited about. It again. I'm only one other person. There, there's people out there that are excited about this new game mode, and I want to 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 push them and 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 be happy for them. But there's some people out there that are, I think are just overhyping it just a little too much. So anyway, let's talk about this first. First off, one, before we get into this, into this mod, you're seeing some Titanfall 2 gameplay. Swear to God, this is new gameplay. Nick would have called me out. I am so rusty. It's not even funny. I am so damn rusty in Titanfall 2. You will believe it. And the gameplay that you're seeing, I even had to change the field of view because I had no idea what I was doing. Um, but it's on PC and I'm uh, fresh. I'm not even like a Gen 1 uh, in this or maybe a Gen 2, I guess. Uh, but yeah, man, fresh gameplay. There you go. I still got it somehow. <laughs> Wiped an entire squad. I look at the thing and it's like, oh my God, Butterbar killed our entire squad. I was like, yeah, goddamn right. I got it still. So anyway, all right. First off, let's talk about this. So there is a streamer workaround mod for Titanfall 2 on PC. So if you're wanting to stream Titanfall 2 on PC, um, Tristan on Twitter is actually the one that has set up a Patreon for a streamer mod for Titanfall 2. So definitely check this Patreon on, uh, Patreon out if you're wanting to stream it on PC. Now, Iniquity has, has boasted about this. He is very excited about it. He has bought it, and he's using it currently right now on Twitch, and he's enjoying it. Everybody's unknown. So I think that's the one thing that, that, that helps with the mitigation is everybody's unknown. How, how easy is it to kind of find what server everybody's playing on or find like, people's location? So that's one thing that's been helping out tremendously with um, kind of uh, mitigating the DDoS attacks. Like I said, if you were wanting, if you're wanting to stream Titanfall 2 on PC, check out this mod and see if it's worth your while. If you're wanting to, I mean, if you're wanting to stream it, I mean, hopefully, you know, donations come in and where you're actually able to to purchase this if, if it's like a money type thing. But 
If you're wanting to have a fun time enjoying it with your audience, enjoying it on stream, playing it with friends, definitely check this out if you're still having issues on DD uh, being having, you know, having those DDoS attacks because I think this will be worth your while. At least for Iniquity and seeing him streaming and seeing him have a good time not only with the audience, uh, but him enjoying playing Titanfall 2 again. I think this is something that for the streamers definitely check this out give this person some love check out the patreon see if it's something that you want to be interested in um and get this mod to where you can enjoy titanfall 2 again on stream enjoy it with your audience enjoy the gameplay and damn it man titanfall 2 i mean good look Eighteen thousand people on pc Woo, man it's a good game it's a good game I, I it sucks to know that not so many people know about it but it's a good game so anyway i just at least want to let let you guys know about that wanted to show his info on twitter or on 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 here to where you can access that patreon um get by the mod and be able to use it on, on stream if you are somebody that is wanting to use it um and play on stream and be able to play with your friends on pc all right so let's go over to apex season nine legacy season whatever it might be so I, at this point it's like whatever. um 3v3 is coming to apex so it's a new game it's a permanent new game mode that they're adding to apex legends so apex is just br all of a sudden boom 3v3 it's Counter-Strike. That's honestly what I'm looking at it. I'm looking at it, it's, it's Counter-Strike. Now I know there's other things out there like Rogue Company and stuff like that that have been doing these, these types of game modes where um, you know it's a survival-based game mode, 3v3, you only have one life, you can do revives and stuff like that, you have abilities, you buy weapons uh, and, and perks and grenades and med packs, all that stuff at the beginning of a round. Um, I'm not seeing this. And Bill, uh, I, I, I wanna preface this. This is not anything against the, the developers. This is nothing against any of the designers, nothing. The game still looks gorgeous. The mechanics and everything of the game is still really damn good. And I don't want this to be a personal attack or anything against the people that are making Apex. I don't see this 3v3 as, as, an, as an innovation. I, I, I'm, I'm just trying to be as honest as possible. You guys can hate me for my opinion, I get that. I don't see this 3v3 game mode as an innovation to Apex. Look, I feel like we've taken a huge step backwards from where Titanfall 2 is at. Now again, I, Titanfall 2 and, and the Titanfall series has offered this, these amazing game modes with AI controlled opponents, uh, 6v6, Titans dropping everywhere, wall running, jetpacking, cloaking, grappling, all these different things that have innovated the, the, the first person shooter genre in such an amazing way that some of the stuff is in, in Apex, the grappling, the, the mirage and all that stuff, all the, uh, all the bamboozling and stuff and cloaking a little bit um, is in Apex. But the innovation that Titanfall 2 was able to do with the, the amount of different game modes is just a little bit, I'm looking at this 3v3 and it's like, I feel like Live Fire in Titanfall 2 did a better job where it had, you know, a capture the flag um, and it was 6v6 or maybe it was 5v5. I can't remember, remember off the top of my head, but even then, you had pilot abilities, wall running, you had the you know, 5v5 or 6v6, a capture point, an objective in the game mode. Then I'm looking at this 3v3 and I'm like, ah. I mean, uh, it's nice to have a different game mode. It's definitely nice to have, you know, something other than BR. But man, oh man, I feel like when you look at Titanfall 2, you look at the game that, that, <laughs> that came before Apex. And it feels like a big step backwards from where titanfall 2 was at now look i mean maybe a titanfall 3 comes doubtful um and maybe titanfall titanfall 3 uh, you know innovates on what titanfall 2 did and just apex is his own little thing you know branched off from titanfall in the titanfall series but man oh man to me personally i feel like it's a big step backwards from what the game modes were were in in titanfall 2 compared to a 3v3 counter-strike type of game mode um, I think it was Black Ops 4 had this type of game mode as well. I can't remember exactly. I think it was called Heist, uh, if my memory serves me right. Um, but yeah, you have Counter-Strike, you have Rogue Company, you have other games out there that have been doing this. And I think this, this, this might be something that, that um, helps out streaming and whatnot. Streaming has been a big thing around BR, or Rogue Company, these Counter-Strike types of things. And I think this is what it's more catered to. It's more catered towards those type of streams and whatnot. But man, oh man, to the casual person, that is wanting to play an um, like an amazing multiplayer experience that Titanfall 2 had. This 3v3 game mode is just not cutting it. And again, like I said, it's nothing against the developers. It's nothing like that whatsoever. 
But to me personally, I feel like it's a huge step backwards from where Titanfall 2 was at with the amount of game modes, the amount of things that were going on in a match to where it felt um, it felt amazing, it felt intense, it felt like there was just so much chaos going on to where I don't know how a 3v3, even with abilities, um, and there's I don't know if there's actually a clear objective in this arena thing. I think it's just 3v3. I don't know if there's a captured point. I don't know if there's an objective in it to where they need to do, you know, do this or that before the time line, uh, you know, the time expires. But from what I'm seeing, it's not a whole lot of anything, you know, crazy or innovative that Titanfall 2 did. So I don't know. That's just at least my personal opinion. Let me know in the comments below. One, how do, have you guys checked out the mod? If you have, let me know in the comments below. Have you checked out the new season uh, nine, this legacy season? Let me know in the comments below what you guys think about the gameplay trailer and this new 3v3 game mode. But again, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please have a great rest of the day and I look forward to talking to you guys all next time.